Hey guys, we'll give this a shot here. I'll show you how to rekey a Callan deadbolt. Same thing for a quick set lock. Uh, the first one I'm doing here is going to be uh, without a key. So this is how you rekey a deadbolt without a key, without a key that works the lock. So normally uh, you'd have to take this out of the door, of course. And then um, the way we're going to get to this thing without the uh, without the key is we're going to get it under this plate. And I have my keying kit down there. And I'm just going to pry this little plate off. There's extra plates in the kit. So if you mess it up, you can, um, you can replace it pretty easy. But I just put a little screwdriver, which doesn't come with a kit. But I just found that this works somewhat well under the edge there and I pry it up now this rekeying without the key happens a lot to you guys probably because it'll be um you're rekeying something that's like the builder ball dropped or something like that so you just pull that plate up you pry it up on like a one corner over here on a side pull the plate up slide it off Try not to bend it up too much. If you can reuse it, that's great. That one's pretty straight. I normally just give it a little flex with my fingers and kind of push it back to being a little more narrow. Now, normally, if you've got a, a builder ball issue, it's normally on this number four cut right here. And if you pull that spring out and um, put the... Um, Take the pin out of this one slot, the top pin. Kind of hard to do and hold for you, but you can see I, I just dropped two pins out of there. The top pin is this one, and this is the bottom pin. Now, um, between these two on a builder key, is going to be a, a little ball bearing these things so I would take the spring out I would take that top pin out I would drop a new builder ball into that slot and then I would just uh, rebuild it from there so you would uh, put the bottom pin in you put a builder ball in and then you'd put a top pin in and then you just stack your springs back on. And then you can put your plate back on. Now, if you're doing a full rebuild or if you're rebuilding it from scratch, you can just take the lock, turn it upside down, dump everything out. Don't put, you know, old pins in with your kit. We can get more pins. You can just throw those things away. But, um... You just take these, dump them all out, like that. You'll take it and look down in there. And I'll look and see if um, you got them all. I don't know if you can see down in there or not in the phone. Not really. But you can normally see if there's a pin still in there. You can also count. There should be, should be 10. There's five tops, five bottoms. And then you just come back and reload it. Um, do your bottom pins first. Put top pins on top of it. Drop your springs in there. And um, you would uh, then you just put on the top plate. And you could you can rekey it completely this way. So see all the curved curve sides go down. Three, 